morning. I'm Kristen Huff and here are the morning announcements. The February National Honor Society meeting that was originally scheduled for Wednesday has been changed. The new meeting day is Friday at lunch in the English open area. The meeting will start at 1250. Mrs. Jones' Spanish II classes are working on research projects for presentations this week. All Mrs. Jones' Spanish II students should report straight to the library. Don't take the hike. This past weekend, FFA members competed in a Lamb Showmanship Contest in Sheldon. Shane Hoffpower placed first in his class, Maggie Klein received fourth in her class, and Dana Ganshirt placed sixth. Congratulations for an outstanding job. Last Friday, Ms. Phillips' French II classes performed skits based on a lesson in which the students had to write dialogues about their new vocabulary. The setting was in the French hair salon, and the students provided various props to add to the scene. The classes enjoyed the activity and felt it was a lot of fun. We, oui, these French really know how to cut hair. Standing by in the newsroom is Heather Jeans for more of Morning Update. Heather? Thanks, Kristen. There will be a math club meeting at 1 o'clock on Wednesday to discuss the spring induction and field trip. The astronomy club is invited to the meeting to find out more about the field trip. Move off with Theta members need to be present for the first part of their lunch to plan the invitation. There will be no TOS math tutoring before school tomorrow since Mrs. Cornelius will not be here. There will be an Interact meeting today in Mrs. Griffon's room at 1. Everyone is welcome. That's it from here, Kristen. Thanks, Heather. Juniors, the time has come to decide on the class flower, song, and motto. Submit your suggestions on the list by the front office by next Tuesday. As we reported on Friday, we are entering the Channel 1 Best Newscast Contest. This Friday's newscast will be sent in as our entry. Throughout the week, we will be practicing various elements of the broadcast, like this unnecessary graphic. Please bear with us. We'll put it all together Friday. Also, teachers, please be aware, Friday's morning update will last 10 minutes, which is the allotted time for the contest. We wanted to wish a happy birthday to Regina Morales, Lynn Doherty, Christy and Katie Offenberger, and Stacy Crane. And finally, congratulations to the following students who made first division ratings at UIL solo and ensemble contest last Thursday. April Austin, Elizabeth Bowman, Angie Brown, Aisha Connor, Darby Gray, Sam Jacobs, Mary Ann Janes, Erica King, James Marshall, Susie Porges, Adam Rose, Massey Sumandi, Carlene Tinkler, and Chris West. Not only was the band busy Thursday, but also Saturday when they marched in the Mardi Gras parade in Galveston. We leave you today with a look at their performance that was carried live on Channel 2. Oh, <laughs> oh great. They've been uh, members of the